Hey guys, welcome back to Honeycomb. My name is Ko. If you are enjoying these videos, please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow along on Instagram at Ko Kosha is my Instagram, but also follow at Daily Drink Mag and at Honeycomb Manila on Instagram. Uh, we wanted to do a video specifically tackling the timers on grinders and how to kind of dial in exactly what that timer should read. So the technical term for this is a, a chronographic uh, measurement, but we'll just use timer just to keep it simple. Kind of the question is, what do you do if you already have the correct grind size, but you find yourself always having to spoon out amounts of coffee to get the exact dose or how to limit the amount of coffee that you're spooning out. And the way to do that is by utilizing your timer to get the exact dosage that you need every time you push that button. So here's how that's done. Uh, I have my dosing cup and I teared the scale so that it says 0, 0.0. So now I know that when I press this button, whatever goes in here, that's going to be the exact weight of what comes out. So I'm going to put that my dosing cup in and press the button. And our grinder ran for 2.71 seconds, which is our setting. And out of the grinder came 15.3 grams. So I'm gonna take 15.3 and put it into my calculator. 15.3 divided by 2.71. So I press divided by 2.71 seconds equals 5.645. Right, so 5.645 grams per second. If you want to get the millisecond, you can divide that even further. But for our, our intents and purposes, we won't do that. It's a little bit too detailed. Uh, but if you want to do it, you can. All right, so how do you use this information? If we know that we are getting 5.645 uh, per second out of the grinder, if we need to get a total of 18 grams out, then I will do 18 divided by 5.645, right, which is our grams per second, equals 3.188. So that's what we're going to set our grinder to now. So I'm going to make that adjustment. We'll empty our dosing cup. And uh, we'll go into our menu and settings set up time for dose one and our target is 3.188 or we can round up to 3.19 all right so we've set it to 3.19 we've teared our scale and now all we have to do is press that button we don't have to purge because we didn't change a grind setting all we changed was the timing setting. And we have 18.1 grams, right? So that 0 0.02 seconds accounted for that 0.1. Now, here in Honeycomb, we require the exact dosage plus or up to plus one milligram, right? Or 0 0.1 gram. Uh, it, it's very difficult to be exactly you know, 18 every time, but we don't allow it for it to be below the target the target weight for our coffee. So our espressos go in at usually at 18 grams. So 18.1, 18.2, it's an acceptable margin for error. All right, so I hope that helped. Uh, I haven't seen a lot of videos about this specific uh, topic online. So uh, hopefully, if you have any questions, you can put them in the comments below and let your friends know, share it with other baristas because I think this is very helpful information. Cafe owners will save a lot of money by knowing this particular trick. And it's a little bit of science for you guys out there. All right, wish you guys good luck. I wish you guys good health. I wish you guys great coffee. Peace.